welcome you Leos. Hey, hey, I'm here. Let's look at the Leos reading. Um, the energy of the star is coming up so much in this week. This is the third week of May, and I want to say thank you for returning, you Leos. Thank you for the wonderful likes, shares, and support. Let's see what's coming out. Please subscribe. Moon readings is coming up soon. The Empress is here. Um, the Knight of Cups is here. Then we have the Emperor. Then we have an organization. Um, you are going to be, um, wow, you Leos, this is a good week. This is a good week, you Leos. You Leos, whatever is happening, this is a fantastic, fantastic week. Now some lies and deceptions are coming out. Um, and this is the saying that is coming out. I'm, I'm just getting the message that is coming. It's seven, of, seven of cups. Some of you are wishing and dreaming that some lies and deception will come out that has to do with an organization or someone in an organization. And it is coming out. It's as if you Leos have been hoping and wishing for this and it's coming out. I love your readings, you Leos. The energy of the sun is here. You guys are really being protected, you Leos. So that is good. I love you, Leos. Um, and this is this is so powerful, you Leos, because you have the energy of the Empress and um, you begin the work week with the, the, the energy of the Empress and you end with the energy of the Sun and this is just so wonderful now in the center is that you are protecting yourself okay you stand strong and you're protecting yourself you're protecting yourself from the Knight of Cups and you are protecting yourself also from um, a situation where the lies and deceitfulness of someone who is a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion. This could be a child, or some of you could be in a relationship. This could be a family member, or it could be just a random person that you have to work out some karmas with. But definitely, you're protecting yourself from this person. And the lies and deception are definitely, definitely coming out, okay? The lies and deceptions are very coming, are coming out. Now... Some of you also could be protecting yourself from a workplace or a, a boss. You're definitely protecting yourself from your workplace and a boss. You are open and wishing for something, a better work, and that is definitely going to be coming in for you, Leo. So, um, as we look, we have the emperor, we have the organization. So um, people, you Leos, who are going to be getting in business, it's a good week. Um, whatever the decision is, um, from Wednesday to Friday, it is good to make that decision. It is good to sign up documents. Um, so go for it. So let's see the Leos for the third week. What is happening for the Leos third week of May with, with the Empress? I don't know. You fire signs are dealing with um, a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. So some of you are dealing with a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. This could be your husband. This could be a father figure. This could be a father-in-law. This could be your boss. But whatever the situation is, is that you guys are dealing with this person. Now, um, it could be that you're dealing with um, a, um, a couple. One is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn and the other one is a Capricorn. But whatever it is, some of you, it has to do with your materialistic. So it could be your boss also. So the king of coins and the empress, what is this all about? It's all about a house. It's all about a house. It's all about um, a, a, a house. It's as if you guys um, were living together and uh, now the house you split up and the house need to be sold and they're stressful thing because it's as if you split up your boat living somewhere else one is living in the house the house need to be sold and the other one is stressing the other one for it to be it's all about financial stability and what it is that is there the knight of cups wants to have something and the knight of cups uh, try to do something very deceiving with a, a situation um with a house and it's not going to happen and um because this knight of cups is going to find himself <laughs> in some really 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 um promising deceptive situation that his way of life is about to um stop okay 
um, is as if this is your child. Some of you could have a, a child that is a Pisces Cancer or a Scorpion. This child tried to do something very deceptive with a house. And as if the father is saying to you, sell the house, get rid of the house. Do not give him. This child could be on drugs. This child could be manipulated in whatever forms. But this child is only out for money. It can also be that he has a bloody ego that he thinks that he's entitled. He's not entitled to anything. Okay? So, all you ladies and gentlemen that have children, the 18 years that you have supported that child, that's the only thing they're entitled to. Okay? So, whoever this child is, let him know that he's bloody not entitled to what you have achieved in your life. The energy of the emperor comes up. And with the energy of the emperor, I keep on doing it the, um, that way. I don't know why. With the energy of the emperor is that there is just going to be a judgment call. And your intuition is right. Listen to your intuition, but you're, you're spiritually protected, okay? There is going to be a judgment call. Whatever this judgment call is happening and that is transpiring, there is definitely, definitely going to be a judgment call. Now, the heavenly masters are here, and definitely you're going to be receiving news from an organization. So, the heavenly masters is here, and you're definitely, definitely going to be receiving news from an organization, letting you know that you have a strong foundation to whatever is happening, whatever is going on, okay? Um... And if you look at this energies, uh, all that is coming out is that some of you are dealing with your kids that think that they're entitled. Um, they're not entitled, okay? Some of you are dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion person that thinks that they are entitled to anything that you have. That's not how it works. No, they're not. Some of you listen to your intuition about your work because you're protected. Even though it doesn't feel like that, you are protected, okay? So it's as if some of you are given the feeling of, ah, you know, I, I really should leave. I really should leave. And... Uh, um, it's, it's as if no, because you're protected, just, just, just hold on, hold on. This is what your angels and guides are saying. Just hold on, hold on. Um, it's as if some of you are feeling as if, yeah, this is, this is just too much and you need to focus on something else. The energy of, um, information is definitely going to be coming out. The sun, what is it bringing up for the Leos? There is definitely going to be a strong family bond that is coming up and an offer that is going to be coming into you. So wonderful, wonderful. And, and this is the reason why I change up the weekly readings and I'm doing it like this. It's because there is so much information that is coming out that I want people to understand that because some people will receive information. Some people won't the way I was doing it. And now I was guided to do it this way because there you have um, the first card is people who are in business, people who are have a house. The second card is about your, your kids. Um, the third card is about people who are deciding or want to leave something. But it's as if the universe is saying, Listen to your intuition. Just hold on. Just think positive that things are going to be falling into place and hold on. And here, you're definitely going to be receiving this message. Some of you who are in management positions, some of you who are in power, um, it's as if you're going to be receiving some message and you're going to be, oh my God, my intuition was right. But you're spiritually protected to whatever it is. You could be in power. You could be a manager. You could be, you could be having, so it says something isn't right. And they're saying, yes, listen to your intuition because it's going to come out in this week that something isn't right. But they're saying this organization is going to let you know that you have a strong foundation. So not to worry about anything, just, um, you know, keep going and keep looking forward because there is going to be much more that is going to be coming up i'm saying there could be an offer of marriage the the ring is here um 
um, money is here some of you could be winning the lottery um, offer of marriage is going to be coming into you whatever is transpiring there's definitely an offer of marriage that is going to be coming into you um, there is definitely a new offer and this new offer listen to your intuition about a house situation because you're going to be offered and a new place of, of, of um, a new a new place to live definitely um, an offer is going to be coming in and you're going to be offered a new place to live um, and um, this offer is coming in from family or it's coming in from a twin flame or a soulmate or someone from the past someone who wants to reconnect with you and build a family with you that is definitely going to be coming in the in the cards there is an offer that some of you are going to be offering someone um, a, a, you know a, a, a engagement is coming in um, some of you are going to be receiving an offer from someone to live together whatever is is transpiring a family someone wants to move in with you and become family with you okay for a private reading you know always connect with me to, to, to find out what you should do now there is definitely some information that is going to be coming out your boss is going to let you in on something or information could be coming in from authority about a family situation the seven of cups is here and the seven of cups is that some of you are in lululand let's see what's happening in lululand Ooh, dream on because the money if ooh, tells you guys bam <laughs> It's nice to be in Lululand. I started calling it Lululand. Well, my angels and guys started calling it Lululand from my start back, started back the reading. Listen, dream on people because if you are dreaming of winning the lottery or having money, it is coming. It is coming, definitely, definitely. If you are thinking about being financial stability, this is going to become a... Uh, a, a, a miracle is going to be happening okay definitely a miracle is going to be happening ten of swords is here what is this ten of swords about the end of the lies and deceitfulness who end of the lies and the deceitfulness ladies and gentlemen I hope you can see this because oh wow finally I'm sure you Leah's are happy um news of uh, you Leah's if you're in a relationship the person is going to say let's take this relationship to another level the person wants to come and live with you the person wants to share their lives with you and go for it I'm, I'm i'm receiving the message for you leo yeah go for it whoever this person is they're coming from a good place and they want to um come in and share their lives with you some of you have some of you felt this some of you kids could be coming back home let them in because if you realize that kids and family members are returning that means that that is what the universe want. That means that it is a time where you need to reconnect with this family member. Okay, so so and and if this family member had just left because they wanted to um, to you know make it on their own, and this is the reason why they left, and and they're coming back now, not because they want something. But they're coming back it could be a past life someone you have met in a past life is returning in your family and they want to have um, a, um they want to connect with you in a, in a in a family way okay so they want to come in as a lover and then have kids and that sort of a thing that is definitely happening for you is that what you want um some of you need to really think about it if that is what you want if that is what you want then go right ahead and do it but you have to first figure out 
what it is that you want, okay? Because um, whoever is coming in is coming in like fast. It's like they're here sometimes and then they're not here. And then you're like, you know something? This is, I don't have any time for this. I think some of you are like, you know, what it is that you want, you know, because um, you seem to make me give it. It's as if you're here today and tomorrow you're not here. We're like, what is it that you want? So I'm seeing this energy definitely, definitely taking place, definitely coming out. And you want to know where's this person, what's happening to this person, and why are you back? Now, for some of you, definitely, if you are looking for a new place to live, definitely you're going to be receiving an offer. So whoever is out there looking for a new place to live, definitely, definitely, you're going to be receiving an offer um, of a new place, okay? So, and some of you are definitely going to be receiving an offer from someone who wants to connect with you and want to connect with you in a very positive way. So it's up to you if you're going to be opening up your life. Some of you have some quotes about this person. So it says, uh, you know, are you playing a game? What is it that you really want? Because it's as if you feel as if this person makes you giddy. It's as if this person is here today and they're not there tomorrow. And this person is making you very giddy and you're like, I don't want to really start something like this. And some of you have questions about this person in this situation, okay? Definitely. If you're looking for a job or a house, that the offer is here. Um, whatever was happening with you and your family, um, it's going to be balanced out okay so if there was uh, um, really unhappy situation with the family and that sort of a thing um, the family is going to be offering you stability okay and definitely look out because someone out there is going to be um, ask the ends of marriage this is good some of you are dreaming to become very rich and it's going to be happening because it's as if you're dreaming and your dreams is becoming a reality, okay? This is a beautiful, I'm using um, the unicorns. It's one of my favorite, favorite. I love the unicorns so much. And it says one step at a time. Just take one step at a time, okay? Don't push, don't rush into anything. For the people who, um, people are coming up and said, hey, um, do you want to move in with me? No. Take your time before you make a decision here. You need to make a decision, but take your time before you make this decision. Lots of little steps make big dreams come true. And this is really a week for that because here you're dreaming of being financial abundant and it's going to really happen. Um, people who are having situation with their kids and their kids are, are, are trying to um, say that they're entitled, you're going to stand your ground and, and, and uh, um, no way, no way. Um, they're entitled to 18 years of your life and the mothers are entitled um, um, to give them a healthy life and a healthy upbringing and that's about what you're, they're entitled to. For the rest, they need to go fend for themselves. So sense of humor comes out and this is just so funny um whatever is happening this is just, I, you know whenever i'm reading the cards for myself and i'm asking archangel michael you know what to do with this um situation or how is the situation going to be turning out and this card comes up it is always thank you for helping me see the humor in the situation so i can um, lovingly laugh at human nature okay I am willing to view my experience in a new light in order to attract love and healing energies in my life and definitely it has to do something with the lies that is about to come out or the lies that have come to an end but it definitely definitely has something to do with some deceptiveness that was going on and the truth finally comes out and it's like people looking as if Ooh, oh oh okay 
ladies and gentlemen see life as a, um as being humorous and enjoy your week it's going to be a brilliant week for the people who are looking for houses people who want to sell houses go right ahead and um jump in do it news is coming from someone who is going to let them let you know they're going to be offering you number one you're going to be offered the ends of marriage which is um someone asking to marry you and number two someone wants to move in with you guys it is just fantastic enjoy your weekly as namaste